teacher Ken and I will be teaching you how to create videos using KineMaster because as we all know we are transitioning from the online learning and this one will be a great help and KineMaster is one of the best video editing apps on Android, iPhone or iPad. Right now it packs in a professional level functionality and this video, I'm going to take you to a complete edit, step by step, so that you will know exactly how to use it. So I will teach you how to create a video presentation, your lesson presentation, or instructional videos using KineMaster. So let's try to find out how will be the step. So the first step is, of course, you need to download the KineMaster app. Second, you prepare all the materials you need. The pictures, the backgrounds, the music, the video for creating the main video for your lesson. Okay, here we go. What I need to do is to open the KineMaster app. Once we open the KineMaster app, we can see this preface here for the KineMaster. So, we just need to click on the plus sign here. The plus button here. There, you will see the select the aspect ratio of the project. We will choose 16 by 9. Since we will be creating a video that can be uploaded into so 16 by 9 after that so this one is the preface of the KineMaster app so the first thing that we need to do is to upload pictures or backgrounds or screenshots of our lesson so for example i have here my pictures for my videos so i just need to add the pictures that i will be using in my lesson presentation or my video presentation so that's the first step you need to include all the pictures of your lesson. Next one is we're going to put transition in our pictures. Just need to click on the button between the pictures and it will present or give you the transition effect so, you just need to choose which transition effect will be best for you. So, there's white, zoom out, clock white, cover, split, and others. But for me, I prepare cover so after that if you want to add a video so you need to have a pre-recorded video for your lesson presentation so you just need to click on the layer you will see media, effect, sticker, text, and handwriting. So for media, if you are going to add videos, pictures, and others, for effect, for transition effects and other things sticker 
for the use of sticker. Text is for adding text if you want to type your lesson. Handwriting if you want to do handwriting. Okay, so if you are going to add video, we will click on the layer media and you have the pre-recorded video so in my case I have here my pre-recorded video and here you can also crop the video and you can move it anywhere you want it you can make it small or you can make it big so that's the good thing about KineMaster it's very easy to navigate okay so you have there the video already next is for example you need to adjust the length of the picture with the video then you can just drag the picture here you can drag the picture so that it will make it longer when it comes to the time frame so after that we are done with the pictures we are done with the videos if you want to add sounds of course you can click on the button here about the audio in audio you can have your songs or background music you can just choose songs in your device then click the plus sign after that you can also add a voice recording if you don't want to show a video but you want to have a voice recording you can do it also by clicking on the record then you start recording it so that's for the voice recorder so again you have the media the audio the layer and record don't forget in putting text if you want to put text you click on the layer and then text and just type the text that you need to write like for example mail 14 then click ok so it can be made bigger smaller ok then there are also animation in it you can change the color change the font of the text and click the button here at the top and you can move it anywhere you want so if you are going to play that one there so you just need to check until the end before you save it 
you can now click the button here to save then you can choose the resolution you need so for me I choose 720 because that is good then you can click the export once you have exported then you have the final video with you so I think that's the basic thing you need to know about making videos here in KineMaster for your own video lesson presentation or instructional videos. Okay, that's it. I hope you have learned something new from me about on how to create your instructional videos for your lesson using KineMaster. Bye-bye!